Hi, my name is Bob Rakes, and I'm here with a couple of highlights of issue 68 of the 8K Association Monitor Newsletter. Improving video codecs is a key part of delivering better video, and especially 8K. Spin Digital has been working in that area for some time, and in particular recently on the VEVC Next Generation video codec. The company produced a white paper that digs into the trade-off between processing complexity and the efficiency of the compression. It also looks at the differences between offline and real-time compression. Ben looked at the white paper and has dug out the key points for readers. He also looks ahead at the demos that Spin Digital will give at IBC in Amsterdam next month. Ben has also been talking to content creators Paramax, who started making programs in 8K as long ago as 2017. And he wanted to know where we're up to in terms of 8K content creation. Paramax focuses on concerts, which may have a lot of interest for a long time. And so it wants to make sure that its content is technically relevant for as long as possible. By recording in 8K and with raw data, it is able to extract better video at a later date. For example, by creating an HDR version of the content. Ben's article looks also at how content can be upgraded and future-proofed using 8K and how the technology is becoming more mainstream for capture and post-production. Ben makes a plea to the industry to help make Paramax's latest music hall project available in its full 8K HDR Dolby Atmos glory. And that's something I'll be looking forward to.